welcome back here in this new video tutorial in learning Microsoft Excel today we are going to learn the easy and effective way of filtering the data in Microsoft Excel here in the screen I have the data of sales that has the data invoice customer name product name quantity sold sales value sales representative and sales manager my requirement here is to filter the data at different level the traditional way of filtering the data is selecting the column header then apply the filter from the data tab then select the filter criteria from every column but here we are going to use a different approach of data filtering that is by using the slicers here you can see different slicer are given by using these slicers we can easily and effectively filter our data for example suppose that if you want to filter your data sales manager wise you can simply click on these sales managers and the data here gets filtered to clear out the filter you can click on this clear button if you want to filter the data sales representative wise then here you can select on different sales representative if you want to select multiple sales representative at one time then you have to click on one then Press and hold the control key in the keyboard then select other now here you see these four sales representatives are selected similarly to filter the data at product level here you can choose different products and the data gets filtered here similarly to filter the data at customer level you can click on different customers and the data is filtered now let's learn how to enable these slicers to filter the data easily for that let me go here in the new sheet where I have only the data I don't have any slicer here to use the slicer first of all we need to convert our data into table format for that select the data from the beginning till the end then click on insert tab then click on table this you can do by the keyboard shortcut as well that is control T this will open this create table dialog box select this my table has headers then click on ok now the data is converted into the tabular structure now click anywhere inside the data then click on the table design tab then click on the insert slicer now here we need to filter our data at four level that is the customer wise product wise sales representative wise and sales manager wise so select the customer name product name sales representative and sales manager then click on ok now here you see the slicers are added now keep the slicers at the top by dragging it at top now put the sales manager slicer at the beginning now make three columns here by going to the slicer tab then here in the columns make it 3 by clicking on these control buttons now decrease the size of the slicer by using these controls put it over here this will be used for selecting the sales manager now for the product name make it 3 columns by going to the slicer then from here make it 3 column then keep it over here decrease its size this way now increase the width of this like this in this way we can resize and reposition the slicers now after arranging the slicers here in this way we can now start filtering our data by clicking on these sales manager the data gets auto filtered to clear out the filter click on this clear button here you can choose different products here you can choose different sales representatives here you can choose different uh, customers if you want to select multiple items you have to click on this multi select then click on the values that you want to deselect for example if you want to take Gita and Sura's in the filter 
then you have to click on these remaining cells representatives these will be deselected and the Gita and Suraj data will be given here to exit from this multi select simply click on the button this you can also do by a different method that is by holding the control key in the keyboard for example if you want to select multiple product here click on the first then press and hold the control key in the keyboard then select other this will select multiple products so this is how we can use the slicers for easy and effective filtering of the data in microsoft excel and this much for today's video thank you very much for watching we will again meet on next video tutorial mm -hmm.